Welcome to Playspot, the home of entertainment. If you're new in this channel, consider subscribe. Don't forget the notification bell for the new content. Ace Ngobo on my Melody Sundance dominance. He says, over the past couple of years, the debates about my Melody Sundance, hogging talent with a view to weakening other clubs, has been a raging debate, amplified by Jabu Mahlang a couple of days ago, on Sisi, tricked by the Kedachif loss and the gap that Sundance has opened at the apex of the Premiership. First of all, I can boldly debunk the might that Sundowns buy players for the merry objective of winning other clubs. I'm saying this because even as most people think that the Motope are the richest club owners, I know that they are very stitch with their money and they will never allow such a scheme to operate. Secondly, I've been at Club Club and have witnessed the hunger that every single player displayed to the coaches, literally giving their all to say to the coaches, I'm not here to add numbers, I want to play a run workshop at other club and have a deeper conversation with the players, coaches and managers. As a football administrator, it was easy for me to identify the winning formula that is not just based on employing good coaches but on the inculcation of organization culture which creates no room to fulfill. What other club would need to do instead of being crybabies about the player signing philosophy at Sundance to ask Sundance to share their strategies with the rest of the other clubs. Each club will still retain its unique approach to things. The spire of how things are done in Sundance from the basic of what every serious football club should be doing. So the added flesh, unique ideas, provide competitiveness, criticism and complaint will never win you games. The very concept of financial fair play has nothing to do with which or how many players a club can sign. So this is the end of the video. Please don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification button for more videos.